Yo, 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 you two, what to do? Hydrix69, aka your mom's here, Mobile Boy, back with another video. And today I'm going to be telling you guys how you could win a new skin as well as a couple emotes if you play in an upcoming tournament on January 8th. I'll be going over the full details in today's videos, but before I get into that, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel, drop a like on this video, and with that being said, guys, let's get it. So the tournament's going to take place on January 8th at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. That is this Friday for anybody wondering. And basically what's going to go on is I'm going to stream some customs like normal like I've been doing the last couple of weeks. And these will just be practice games. The tournament's going to be only one game. So just make sure to come practice and play your best. Requirements to be entered for the tournament and get into the game will be make sure you're subscribed to our channel of course as well as Illumix who's also hosting this and he's going to be the one giving away all the prizes. Him and Jason who were the ones who set this up were basically in charge of this whole thing and I'm just going to be the one streaming it so I thought this would be fun for you guys to maybe win something in the item shop. So once you're subscribed to both channels I'll have Illumix link down below. Make sure you follow Illumix on Instagram as well as Jason, which I'll also have their Instagrams down below. And I'll have that comment pinned so it's easy for you guys to find these links. To ward off teamers and stream snipers, once you guys have subscribed to the channels and followed the right accounts, you're going to send a screenshot to Jason on Instagram mentioning in a story that's saying you're tournament ready. And since you've already qualified, Jason will give you a link to a Discord channel. And this Discord channel is where I will put out the code for the game and it'll just help avoid any like stream snipers or teamers. So I think that should help it go a lot smoother. It is a little bit complicated to get in. So if you didn't understand any of the rules, I'm gonna pop up a photo in a second and that'll basically explain stuff. But once again, feel free to ask me any questions down below in the comments. And in my pinned comment, you will see the links for all the channels you need to subscribe to as well as any um, accounts that you need to follow to get in. Should be definitely super fun and uh, should be a really nice stream in my opinion. If you guys are confused about any of the steps, now's a good time to pause the video and read some of the rules here. And yeah, that's a Lumix's channel, that's his logo, so make sure to subscribe to him as well as our channel right now if you aren't. And yeah, this video is pretty sick, uh, got a lot of really nice kills. So I would recommend just keep watching this video as well. I might talk over a little bit and do some tips and tricks because I think I've covered all of the rules in the tournament. But uh, let me just check real quick. Yeah, I think that's really it for the tournament. One thing to remember, there are already around 60 or 70 people in the Discord for this tournament. So you're going to want to make sure you get in the first lobby very quickly. Um, make sure you're on it and on time for the stream. I would recommend having notifications turned on for my stream so you know when I start going live to kind of get some warm up games in so you can get a feel for who's playing and how to play in this tournament. And good luck to everybody. This should be really fun i know i've said that but uh i really do think this is going to be fun and hopefully can do a lot more of these i think it could be cool to do some more uh, kind of tournaments for like some skins or maybe some v-buck cards and also a reminder make sure to get in your edit contest video you have until the 6th so today and tomorrow to upload a edit video if you guys are unclear on the rules for that um, you could win some V-Buck cards, a $2,800 V-Buck card, as well as a $1,000 V-Buck card. And all the rules are in the video I have pinned when you first click on our channel. So it should be easy to find. If you have any questions about anything I went over in this video, just let me know. And I just realized I still got a decent amount of video left for this. So I'm just going to talk over with some of my tips and tricks for you guys. Low key, this should really help you guys out if you're still playing Fortnite Mobile and uh, give you a heads up because I don't think everybody will watch this far into the video. So if you want to hear some of my latest tips and tricks that I've been using in game, uh, make sure to keep listening. The biggest thing I've been doing lately is dropping agency and just getting the grappler immediately and then basically ditching unless I know there's a ton of guys there. Usually there aren't more than two teams that drop agency. So if you guys are looking for high kill games, I would definitely go agency or what is it, authority now and try and get the grappler. And then based on the bus path, that's where you're going to want to rotate next. If it goes through salty and then to the middle of the map, you're going to want to go to salty first and then to pleasant just because that's where most people drop if they're hot dropping 
or they're going to authority. So that's where you're gonna find the most people. But if it's basically like the opposite direction and it hits like the lazy retail caddy areas, you're gonna go authority and then go in that direction. And you should still find a lot of people in lazy if you're able to rotate very quickly. That's something I would really practice on if you guys are trying to get better at the game and playing pubs a lot is making sure your rotations are very quick and you can bounce around from team to team getting kills really quickly and just getting a lot of kills without worrying about your guns, mats, or heals. Since we've been stuck on the same season for so long, something else I've been trying to work on whenever I can is getting good with weapons I would never pick up. Basically, you're just gonna wanna be good with everything. So whether it's pistols, it's tack shotguns, which I don't really like, maybe you like them, um, maybe you don't like charges make sure you use charges just kind of switching up the weapons to keeping everything like a good skill set in your game and this will really help you no matter what guns are in the game because you'll already be used to them and ready with them hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to drop a like if you did and subscribe to the channel for more peace